Aloha tribe, Sadie here. I am wildly outspoken and I'm here to help you find your dreams, uncover the old ones that you maybe have forgotten, to define who you are, and then to manifest your truth. That's what I'm here to help you do because hopefully when all is said and done, you'll be wildly outspoken too. So today, we're going to be talking about dreams, you know. So tell me your dreams. You know, are they new dreams? Are they dreams you've tucked away, waiting for the day when it'll be just right to bring them out and think of them again? Or did you just put them away forever, thinking that you'll never see them again? You know, have you forgotten what it feels like to have those dreams around? Well, let's take those dreams out the new ones and the old ones. Let's put them on the table and let's play with them. You know, what do they feel like? How do they taste, smell, sound? Now, I don't want you just to see yourself as an observer watching your dreams play out before you. I want you to be the dream. I want you to be in there. I want you to feel what it's like again to experience that longing that passion and just let it all flow be in it be mindful and your assignment until we meet next time if you choose to take it is to be mindful of the emotions the sensations the sights the sounds the touch what it feels like to be in that dream and then let everything else go. The expectation of what that dream looks like, of how you're gonna make it happen, of how it'll turn out, just let it go. Because that's not what's important. What's important is how do you feel? What is it that you're experiencing? Because in reality, when you look at it, we have dreams not necessarily because we want the things in the dreams, but because we want the way it makes us feel. So, I want you to practice holding on to those feelings and those sensations and let everything else go. The next time we meet, we'll work on defining and refining. So, until next time, peace and blessings.